mentality. That's what we have to have from the VSG diet. I've, I'm looking at so many videos and I'm seeing so many complaints from people, especially right when they're starting the pre-op diet, right when they are about to get on this pre-op diet. And I just think the mentality just isn't there. So I'm hoping to shed a little bit of light uh, for some people that either A, haven't had the VSG surgery yet or thinking about getting the VSG surgery or B, those of you guys that are about to get on the VSG journey like myself, we have to have the right mentality in there. I mean, there, there's always there's these little guys out there that's either sitting on your shoulder or just telling you, just, you can't do it. Yeah, I can do it. I know I can do it. You know, it's, it's one of those things you can't sit back and say that you can't do it all the time. Don't let anybody else tell you that you can't do it. You know, it's just like, it's too hard. Yeah, I, I know it's gonna be hard. It's not supposed to be easy. I mean, the, the journey itself is something that you have to just engulf into yourself and make it as one. You can't just expect everything to be given to you on a silver platter. I mean, this VSG sleeve surgery is a tool. It's not in itself just gonna help you lose weight. It's something to help you to change your lifestyle to get to where you're gonna be. You're gonna have a lot of changes. You used to having all types of food in your life and you're going to you're so hungry. Yeah, I, I know I'm gonna be hungry. That's that's kind of a part of it. I mean, it's just, you're used to having an abundance of food. You're not gonna have an abundance of food anymore. You have to change the way you think. You gotta change the way you're doing things and you can do it. I mean, you, if you set your mind to it, can do anything. Don't let that little man above your shoulder tell you what you can and cannot have, cannot be, cannot do in your life. This is all the food that you get. Yeah, I know that's all that you can have. It's just, it's one of those things that you're not gonna have this big plate of food anymore. It's its a normal serving size. Is what we think that, hey, that this may be all that we can get, but it's not all that we can get. This is what you're supposed to have in the first place. Now, I know there's some things out there and there's some quotes that I even saw that was actually pretty phenomenal. I wanted to read you um, one of the quotes that I, that I have here. It says, you have to have a mentality as if you were running a business. This isn't a hangout or having a good time. So if you have the mentality of losing weight is an actually same thing as you running a business. If you had your own business and you put your life savings into it, are you gonna go in there and just kind of like, you know, just, just shoot the crap all day, you know, half it, you know, it is what it is. Or are you gonna try to do something? Are you gonna try to be the best business you possibly can? The same thing with your health. You've gotta do what you gotta do as if you were owning a business with your own health. You've got to sit there and say, hey, look, this is the way things are now. I'm the reason why I'm the way I am. I'm the reason why I'm unhappy right now. And what are you going to do to change that mentality? That's what this whole video is about. Changing your mentality for success for the long haul. I've got another quote for you here. It says, we get so caught up in how much we let ourselves go and about how much we weigh that I am not what happened to me but I am what I choose to become. So yes, you've gotten to this part, into this place. We've gotten really caught up into where we are now in our lives. But what are you gonna do? You are defined yourself by what you will become in the future. Do you have what it takes to get where you wanna be? Like I said, nothing's handed to you on a silver platter. You've gotta do what you have to do. Either you're doing it for yourself you're doing it for your loved ones, for your children, for your you know, for your own health, right? For anything. Find out why you're doing that and stick to that. Keep that mentality. We have another one here. This is one from Kobe Bryant that I really really liked and I wanted to share this with you guys. We don't quit. We don't cower. We don't run. We endure and we conquer. Are you gonna conquer your weight loss? Because that's something you need to ask yourself. Before you get started into this pre-surgery, pre-op diet, the liquid diet stage, before you even have surgery, are you willing to endure and are you willing to conquer whatever fears you may have? You have to be able to get outside of your box to change your life. That's what I'm doing and that's what I hope these videos that I'm making can help for you. If you're one out there that's looking for VSG surgery and you need some help, Think about it. Leave, leave a comment down below. How do you feel about having surgery? Are you ready? Are you excited? 
Are you nervous? Are you having second thoughts? Are you ready to just jump in here? Do you have what it takes to be successful in your weight loss journey? Now, I have one last one here. It says, destiny answers largely to the quality of your mentality. So in other words, wherever you're wanting to end up, if you want to end up at, a, at 100 pounds lighter, does your mentality get you to 100 pounds lighter? You've got to think about that. Now, I know this was a short video. I wanted to get this out here, but if you guys want to see how I'm preparing for my pre-op diet, just click here. See you guys on the next video. Click it.